Hi, my beautiful friends. Okay, so we all know the heifer's having a boy. Um, and I guess that's why she's... Was this always blue? Or was that new? Did it used to be pink? I don't know. Maybe it didn't used to be anything, but I don't know. I just... <laughs> maybe it's just because I know she's having a boy. That should have been the... Um, the giveaway right there if that's not what her usually her usual thing is I don't remember anyway um I did watch one minute of it last night just watch the gender reveal because I was still awake when she posted it I was awake late last night and I was watching a movie and I just checked and yeah um she'd uh, posted so I watched it I only forwarded it to where the gender reveal was so I haven't watched before or after um so yeah, let's get into it and let's do a react. All, all I remember seeing is, because I was tired, but all I remember, sorry, not seeing is Yaman. So I don't remember if he was in it, if he said anything, but yeah, okay. Let, let me stop talking and let's get into it. Welcome guys. This is going to be such a fun vlog. I am kind of fresh getting up here, so don't mind me and my appearance. I got back from vacation. You always look like shit especially in the morning. So we're used to your shit appearance. Last night, Yara picked us up. Our plane landed, but we didn't end up getting like out and with our luggage till after four. And then by the time we brought my mom back, drove home, we picked up dinner on the way. We didn't get home till, I don't know, like six or so. Of course she picked up dinner on the way. All those fucking annoying fingers. So, um, and then I unpacked actually. Hey, you touching your ear again. You gonna smell it again? I unpacked last night. Shocking. I tell you the packing cubes. They really help. They just make it easier. Um, because I had all my things car compartmentalized. It's easier to unpack though, because it's mostly just like dirty clothes, you know. But it was really great to see Yar and Bruno last night. Bruno and Yar had a great week. They bonded heavily, but um Oh go fuck yourself. They bonded heavily. Would they make love to each other? Fucking hell. They bonded heavily. Did were you there? No. You weren't there. You're so fucking full of shit. I mean, I'm sure they were in the same room together at one stage, but I doubt very much that he took the time to sit with him and bond with him. Fucking idiot. He bonded heavily. Bonded heavily. Yeah, because she had cameras going. Actually, I'm surprised she doesn't have... You know what, guys? She probably does when she's gone. Maybe she has those... You know that you can get those little spy cameras and just put them in places? She's probably got them in places that he doesn't even fucking know. She keeps an eye on him to see what he's doing. I definitely, I miss my little baby. Today's a big day. Oh, fuck off. You don't even miss him when he's there. You don't go play with him in the backyard and all of a sudden you miss him. Today is not just Easter. Today is Easter slash gender reveal with my family slash mom's birthday. So when I was in Florida, Yar held down the fort. He went and got three different balloons. We've got happy birthday. Oh, that's fucking bullshit. I call bullshit on that. I call fucking bullshit on that. Yaman did not, did not get them. If he did get them, went and picked them up, I believe maybe he went and picked them up because she's pre-ordered them. He didn't just go and get them. What does she mean he held the fort down? Is he fucking five years old? Were you expecting the house to be burnt down? He held down the fort. Oh, and he went and got her those balloons. That's because you pre-ordered them, Alexandra. You pre-ordered them. He didn't, He. she wants to make out he's into all the stuff that she's into and he's just not. So don't fucking make it like he went and got these. He thought of doing this because he didn't. Bunny, and then this says boy or girl on it. Since we live like not super far. Seriously, she must think we're fucking stupid to believe that he he just got up and oh let me go and get her mother a birthday thing and let me get a rabbit, a bunny rabbit, and let's get a um yeah let's get this. I'm I'm sure the boy girl thing. For my family, but far enough where they're all coming over today anyway for Easter. We're like. Let's just do like a big, a big fun celebratory day. So we're going to have Easter. I don't understand why she's having a cel celebratory day with all this stuff and his family is not included. Where is his family, Alexandra? Why don't you have his family and your family in the same room? Are you embarrassed because your family are a bunch of hecklers? Oh, that Jerry Springer style family. <laughs> and, his, and his family is so classy. That's why you don't want them together. I think it's really fucking rude that she made this huge big deal gender reveal thing of telling her fam his yeah, her family and leaving his family out. That, that's just, just fucking rude. Where is your voice, Yaman? Do you have a set of balls? Fucking hell. At this point, I think Bruno has bigger ones than him. Easter dinner and do the gender reveal cake pops that I made that are so Disgusting. ugly. <laughs> 
I literally thought about like doing something different, but I put, I put my heart and soul into those cake pops, so we're just gonna, <laughs> gonna go along with that. I took them out of the freezer. They, they were so disgusting. When I quickly watched last night, I could see they were falling apart as soon as someone took a bite. That just looked so bad. I'm gonna let them thaw, put in the little sticks in the bottom, and then we'll, I think I'm gonna have like everyone go around, like take a bite and like see who gets. Oh shit, <laughs> I'll edit that out. <laughs> Oh, she is so fucking irritating. She is so irritating. I reckon she did that on purpose. Pregnancy brain is so real. I ordered these on Amazon. There's way too many. Who's she talking to? She's looking over somewhere and he's not like he's even there. So I really don't know who she's talking to. Yeah, I'm going to definitely like save these for the future, see if someone else uh, wants them. They didn't have any packs that weren't like a ton of them, but I got these on Amazon and look how cute these little stickers are. So I want to see everyone's guest beforehand and put a little sticker on. She had to buy them on Amazon, even though she knew she was going to get a lot more than what she got. She, they had to be aesthetically pleasing. She could have just got a blue and pink sticker. You know those round circles that you can just buy and you can pretty much buy them from the news agency or anywhere. Round circles. No, she had to buy these and naturally half of them are going to waste. I think it's a uh, boy or girl. So that'll be fun. I think a lot of my family is like half and half on it, but we'll see. I can't really remember. So <laughs> can't remember anything with the pregnancy brain. But I'm glad a lot of you guys had said, um, I posted the last part of the vacation vlog. A lot of you guys said you also had like hearing issues during pregnancy, but it's not like. No, no, they didn't. A lot of your your um, commenters were saying that they didn't, they didn't have ear problems, and a lot of them were saying that it might be blood pressure related. Um, did you want to mention that? No, of course not, because you know health and weight are not the same. Actually, hearing rather than just pregnancy brain, like trying to process hear, hearing things. And then I also Amazoned this adorable like set of stuff to decorate my mom's birthday cake. Yar went and picked up this really pretty cake with like sprinkles all around it. Isn't it amazing the way Yar went and did everything? Yar went and did this. Yar went and did that. Just to make us feel that he really loves her fucking family. She's probably fucking done it all. So I'm going to do this like decoration kit and I'll show you guys. Do you want to give him a fucking award? Even if you did go and pick up the cake, do you want to give him some award? That's what husbands do. They help out. How it looks, it's got like balloons. It's really, really cute. Amazon, God bless Amazon, really. And then I also grabbed a happy Easter. Hi, baby. Hi. God bless Amazon. Did she, those words actually fucking come out of her mouth? Do you notice as soon as we said, guys, she's going to ignore Bruno, how she's overly giving him attention now? Hi, baby. Hi, baby. Oh, can you just imagine how fucking annoying this face is going to be when her baby's born and she's playing with it and showing us on camera? Did you with your mom? I missed you. Um, let's see, how do I get this out? Oh, thank God, it's pretty strong. This happy Easter banner and these pastels. It's so cute. And then there's an Easter one also with like bunnies. It's so cute. It's like with a wool string and I don't know if it's burlap fabric, but I think it's really cute. I want to save it. So my family's actually bringing most of the food, which is so nice. Like ham, mashed potatoes, broccoli casserole, like a bunch of stuff. I'm in charge of mac and cheese. Um, and then we have like mom's birthday cake, the cake pops. And then I'd also remember I bought all that Easter candy to do like an Easter candy board. <laughs> so per usual. Easter candy board. You bought junk and chocolate and lollies because that's what you want to eat. We've got too much dessert, but that's fine. We've got our... Yeah. I wonder why. I wonder why. Could it be because Alexandra does have a fucking sweet tooth? Could that be it? Why? Heifer? Pretty Easter plates. These were from Walmart. I picked these up well. They are beautiful plates, those. I like them. At least they're elegant paper plates. Back in the vlog. And then I got these adorable little bunnies. Oh, she had to go and fuck it up with them. She got something so nice. And she had to go fuck it up with those bunnies. For, like, the cake dessert plate. This was also from Walmart. I don't know why it's got, like, dust on it. I'll wash it. But I'm going to do my... She doesn't know why it's got dust on it. Look at that face. Oh, my God. Oh my God, you are so fucking irritating, girl. You are so fucking irritating. It's got dust on it because it's been sitting on the shelf. They're not going to go through each one and fucking clean them and dust them. Candy board on here. Super. Do you see how excited she got to tell us that was her candy board? Have a look at her face. For like the cake dessert plate. And this was all she's got to tap it with her fingernails. So from Walmart, I don't know why it's got like dust on it. I'll wash it. But I'm going to do my candy board on here she's a fucking bitch she really is at this point i think she's trolling because she knows we hate all that stuff so she does it on purpose to troll us 
Super cute. Happy Easter. Super cute. Do you realise that you sound like you have a fucking speech impediment? I mean, you really do with your lisp. And now you sound like a speech impediment person. Super cute. Napkins. I got some of this like edible grass to like put around the edge of the candy board. I think that would look cute. Little bunny sea salt caramels. Some of these. And like my family's gonna have to take a bag to go because I know there's gonna be so much of this left over. Shh. <laughs> yeah, right, Alexandra. Right. You're really gonna say to your family, take some candy home. I'm sure you are. Yep. Okay. Sure. Whatever you say. Just like you're a size 18. That's how much I believe you. But nothing like a little goodie bag to take with you. Mm. With Cadbury eggs. Sure. Where's the goodie bags then? If you had that in mind, you would have already had the goodie bags ready. There's no goodie bags. You're fucking full of shit. The best. Reese's eggs. I tried to get mostly like small bags where I could since I just want like a plethora of option. These little, these little chicken chocolates. Got classic jelly beans. Of course, you got to have peeps. I just don't believe how much she gets. Seriously, is all that fucking needed? Reese's mini eggs. That's cool. Soft jellies and mini bunnies. So <laughs> I can whip up the candy board on the earlier side. It's almost nine o'clock. They're coming at one. I think I just need to get ready. I have my mom's presents right there. My mom's birthday is tomorrow, April 1st. So I'll probably see her tomorrow too. So I'm gonna see if she wants this today or tomorrow. God. She bought one fuck all that stuff and she knew she had bought all this stuff and she only bought one one of these plates. Fuck she's dumb. She is so dumb. So you can't even see what's in there. She's got so much shit in there. That's pretty. I like that. I like the colours on that. That's nice. I like that. VQ. 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 Oh, he mustn't have been talking much. Huh? Yeah. Oh, yeah, VQ. 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 Oh my God. That's her mother's cake. So she bought it from the same place she bought it from last year. She always, it was pretty much the same cake that she bought her mum. Do you remember last year she said, um, oh, don't judge me. Everyone judges me when they say, oh, look, she only bought her mum from a cake from blah, 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 blah. That's where she wants it from. All right, guys. Remember when she said that real bitchy last year? That's the, that's the same cake that she bought her last year. You think she would fucking make her something a bit special? How about you just make it yourself so it, you know. It makes your mum feel a bit more special, but no, she's too fucking lazy. I have to say, that does look nice. That little banner. I've never seen anything like that. That's adorable. And they're meant to be balloons. I, I like that. But it's a fucking child's cake. Does this look like an adult woman's cake? No, it's embarrassing. Okay, I just did my makeup for today. Even did a little baby wing and some lashes. Here I was in the shower right behind that wall. And then I crimped my hair. Did we fucking need to know that? Did we need to Yaman? No, Yaman was in the shower behind that wall. I really need to get my roots done. I think it's been... No shit. Did you just realize that you need to get your roots done? I feel like it's only been like a month and a half. I don't know. I do feel like my hair has been growing really fast. Honestly, since starting to take prenatals like two years ago. Um, but here is the dress. I've had it hidden here. That dress, dress is fucking ugly. It is so fucking ugly oh my god it's horrendous absolutely horrendous ugly 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 she's had it hidden here she said i've had it hidden here you, you don't have to hide things from us because it's not like we can come through the camera and open your fucking doors you can just put it somewhere you can put it in your closet you don't have to hide it somewhere um <laughs> trying not to vlog it for like over a month um it was the last why? Because you couldn't hang this up in your fucking wardrobe? You were hiding it here behind the door? God, you're a fucking idiot. You're just an idiot. This one they had an XXL and it's so pretty. It's from Ivy. Say it. Be, pr be proud. 
Be proud and say XSL after your bariatric fucking surgery. Meanwhile, I went on the treadmill last night at 20 to 10 at night. 20 to 10 at night because I loved getting two hours in. I did an hour in the morning. I wanted to get an hour in at night. And I'm thinking on this of this heifer while I was on the treadmill thinking, I wonder if um, she's ever done this. It felt like the need to have to get on and, and do twice um, twice in one day. But no, she doesn't even do once in one day. City Co. I've got their dresses before, but I bought it like the second I saw it because I was looking for like gender reveal dresses and this was my favorite. It's like smocked at the top. She was looking for gender reveal dresses. Dear Jesus, does it have to be a gender reveal dress? You could have, oh my God, no, I'm just not going to say anymore. I've got like tears down it, but it's pink and blue. It's fucking ugly. It's fucking ugly, Alexandra. And it's the only thing that fit you. That's why you bought it. So it's just very fitting, of course. Um, but yeah, it's already like 12.15. So I took my time doing my makeup. I was talking to Lily. So I got to do my dress jewelry and then i gotta go put the mac and cheese in the oven you don't even know what you're in for today you're about to have a very good day with lots of people that you love we got to put on your easter shirt okay guys here is the dress on oh. got my slippers on um but i love it it's so cute so just do you notice how every time she wears a fucking dress she has to start lifting it from the sides she can't just let it drop and let us see what it looks like just like that she has to be touching her hands all over the fucking dress Oh my God, look at that gap in between her toe. The weight of her foot more, moves more to the right and I think it pushes her toes over. Super ringy. And it's like super, super stretchy and comfy. And then I bought two necklaces from... And ugly. For really real ugly. Bucks or buy one going 50% off. This is only 20 bucks. And it's got like the little clovers on it. Cloves, clovers. <laughs> Big neck friendly. And then I'm wearing Miranda Fry. Miranda Fry, a little huggy with the heart. Miranda Fry. I'll link everything. Whew, I'm out of breath. The oven is preheating. You are always out of breath. Isn't it amazing how now she wants to keep saying that she's out of breath. She wants to acknowledge that she's out of breath. But before, when she wasn't pregnant and she was just fat, and she still is just fat, there's hardly any baby in her anyway, um, she didn't want to acknowledge that she was ever short out of breath. She never acknowledged it, but now all of a sudden, because she wants to say it's baby related, just to remind everyone that she's pregnant, she wants to keep saying that she's out of breath. For the mac and cheese, I bought the frozen kind. I had Yara pick it up from Whole Foods, but it's just so good. And I'm going to add like a topping to it myself, jazz it up. And you guys know I love to make some sort of like mocktail for these kind of things. They're just so fun. So I had him pick up stuff for that yesterday as well. So let's make a fun little mocktail. It's 1236 and people will be here at one. So these are the frozen mac and cheeses these are oh my god she couldn't even make a mac and cheese from scratch everything is packaged she hasn't made anything so really she's just heating it up gee she reminds me a lot of what's her name that woman that i've been vlogging on lately alicia from the doughty dozen fire if you ever need a little cheap mac and cheese i've got my trusty drink dispenser is there a word for this pitcher no no. Now I'm going to take no. every last bit of ice I it's have in the freezer. Alright, that's that's a good amount of ice. Go freezer. Okay, so I got a plethora of things here. And I she loves saying plethora. Plethora. That's how you meant to say it. Uh, I bought a plethora, not a plethora. No, how much I would need. So I had him. Yes, it's too so filling. This is actually crust for the mac and cheese and then throwing it in the oven. And I ended up putting both of the Italian sodas. This whole thing of lemonade and about two. So the only thing she really made was this. Everything else was bought. Two thirds of this one and it tastes perfect. I also added lemon and mint kind of just to make it pretty, but it'll infuse over time. So it tastes delicious. I tried a little bit. Wow. <laughs> Look at Cha Cha. Oh, he is so cute. I love Cha Cha. She got him on the table where people are going to eat. Yes. She's got her on the table. Brody, can I do shut up? Sit, sit, sit. Go boy. Look at your cute shirt. So beautiful. Oh, Oh, Max is <laughs> Alright, because this is a short one, let me um, make it go normal. Boy, Mimi is team boy. Team girl? Yeah. She switched over from girl to boy. This is me, I can't decide. <laughs> Grandpa? Team girl. girl. Okay, team girl. Uh, ciao, ciao. Thank team girl. you. Team boy. Team I'm girl. Boy. Boy. I'm official team boy. I'm official boy. Team boy. Alright, so here are my horrible... I just can't believe she didn't have any of Yaman's family over. I oh, know I can't. I can't believe. Actually, 
Fucking have you even seen was Yaman in that? Have team girl. Oh, I- he's he's over by the kitchen. Sorry, he's over by the uh, sink. Yawning. Boy, look at your cute. Hang on, have a look. Dude, so beautiful. Oh. Max is team boy. <laughs> Mimi is team boy. Team girl. Yeah. She switched over That's from true. girl to boy. This is me. I can't decide. <laughs> Grandpa, team yes. girl. girl. My horrible cake pops. Made with love. Yeah, we got. Ciao, ciao. ciao. Thank girl. you. Can you see him here? He's just here. He's so disassociated from her fucking family. It's not funny. It's really not funny. Team boy. <laughs> team. Oh my god. Oh, you know what? I just want to go over and give them all a fucking hair makeover. All of their hair, except the men, are horrible. All of it. Her hair's horrible. Her hair's horrible. The other blonde lady, which is Nancy's sister, her hair's horrible. Fuck. What's wrong with these people? Girl. Official boy. I'm official team boy. boy. See, her hair's horrible too. All right, so here are my horrible cake pops. Made with love. Yeah, we got Stevens because Jan told me. Thanks, baby. But you are boy. Thanks, baby. Thanks, baby. I am a boy. Girls, that's cringe. Oh! <laughs> oh my god, they are so bad. She had them in. They're still in the freezer? She said she was defrosting them. Why are they still in the freezer? <laughs> it's definitely not. <laughs> yes, see? Oh no, they're not in the freezer. Sorry. It's that middle part there. These are my uh, gender reveal Ooh. cake pops. So one at a time, I'm going to. And I take it back about all the men having nice hair. What the fuck's going on with his face? Oh my God. Do you know who he looks like? I don't know if you guys know. Look, I'm way older than some of you guys. But he got he... <laughs> Oh, you guys, I've got to look up. Um, uh, oh, fucking what is their name? Oh, oh God. God, hang on, hang on. The Marx Brothers? <laughs> I don't know if you know who I'm talking about. He looks like one of the Marx Brothers, the one that played the deaf character, and he always used to honk this little thing in his hand. His face, he looks like one of the Marx Brothers. He had like curly, he, he almost looked like a clown in it. It was, he was meant to have like blonde curly hair. I swear to God, he looks like the, one of the Marx Brothers. <laughs> I'm gonna have you guys all take a bite. His hair is horrible. I, one of you lucky people will get the one oh. with the color. Oh. I don't know who's gonna get it, oh. but hopefully, uh, so so don't put the whole thing in your mouth. Nope, you're gonna Just bite, bite it. it. <laughs> Just get your off. Don't put the whole thing in your mouth. Who said that? Why would you even put the whole thing in your mouth? Just uh, it's not great. <laughs> Just hold the ball part. Oh good, I made enough. Oh, I hope it's not that one. That would be hilarious. <laughs> oh good, I made enough. She says. Like, she didn't know how many people she was expecting. Oh, my God, that cha-cha is so damn cute. And as if her mum doesn't fucking know that what she's having. Seriously. I'm going to have to look at her mum's reaction in this. We're going to wing it. It'll be the colour on the inside of it. <gasps> oh, my God. Look how it just fell apart. <laughs> look at her face. No. No. <laughs> oh, my God. They are so bad. No. <laughs> no. Do they taste good? Mm. They're mm. good. Oh, they are good. Right, Credit, did really you get good. it? No. 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 Wow. What are the chances? No. 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 Jenny. It's only two left. <laughs> it's a boy. Yeah. Sorry. She doesn't. She number one. The mum's face. Let's just go back. No. The mum's face already looks bitter here. I don't know why. No. No. <laughs> Jenny? Watch the mum's face. Sorry, two left. <laughs> it's a boy. Do you see Nancy's face? There is no reaction at all from Nancy. There is no reaction at all. So you mean to tell me that your mum didn't fucking know that you were having a boy? There's nothing wrong with telling your mother, but she's trying to... You know, she tries to play us stupid you know like yeah they're gonna think that we, i didn't tell my mum what i'm having sure my asshole my ass and i'm sorry her fake reaction it was just let's have a look at her reaction now okay no no <laughs> jenny 
And can we look at the way she's standing so fucking awkward, the way she's crossing her arms? She has put so much fucking weight on. It's not funny. So it's your left. <laughs> Okay, now Yarman's, we, we heard that yay from Nancy, but we all know that she's full of shit because she already knew. She didn't even look that fucking thrilled that it's a boy because we all know she wanted a little mini me. She wanted someone that she could go to the day spa with, that she could um, do her toes with and having a girl's day out and this and that. She can't say that now, can she? No, she can't because she's having a boy. And I know Yarman is filming this, but do we get a fucking reaction at all? Do, do we get a Yaman reaction at all? Like, guys, I'm really happy I'm, I'm having a boy or I'm, you know, I was happy with whatever I was going to have, whatever. No, no, we don't get a word from Yaman. <laughs> Can't wait to meet a little boy this September. <laughs> Mimi is cutting the ham. <laughs> oh, God, that ham looks horrible. Oh, so does this. Broccoli casserole, my mac and cheese, potatoes, rolls, and yeah. And the cake pop. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Look how many people there are there, and she's got this tiny fucking little dingy cake. Birthday, dear Grandma. Happy birthday. Well, I have to say, there's a lot of the chocolate that went, isn't there? There's a lot of the chocolate and stuff that went. To you. Oh my God. I think his name was Harpo. Harpo Marks. I think that's the one. Wait, guys. I want you guys to look him up. Hang on. Harpo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was Harpo Marx. Please look him up. Please look Harpo Marx up and then, like, pause this, look up Harpo Marx and then look at this guy's face. He fucking looks like him. So pretty. <laughs> God, couldn't she get a smaller cake? Fucking hell. Six and a half hours later. All right, you guys. It I'm tired. I am exhausted. It's 8.20. Um, my family left, I think around five or six, and Yara and I have just been like cleaning up, hanging out. Um, we heated up some of the food from earlier, but today it was so much fun. I don't think I vlogged like a ton, so I apologize, but I know I needed- No, you don't apologize. You don't apologize because you don't fucking mean it. People who apologize should mean it. And you're one of those people who just says sorry for not even being sorry. To vlog <laughs> the, uh reveal so my aunt screaming my aunt getting the cake pop was honestly so perfect um, why why was it so perfect that she got it wouldn't it have been more perfect if your mum got it do you even know what you're saying that was so much fun i was so curious who was gonna get it and she was the one that changed her sticker from girl to oh who fucking cares changed her sticker um and then when yara did it it was boy so i thought that was really funny I'm so glad I can finally tell my family. Yeah, like you hadn't told your mum already. I literally, I text Mimi like. I what about Yaman's family? You gonna mention them at all? Every day, cause she has her little iPad, and she talks to all of us like via text all the time. And I just kept almost letting it slip to her, like little baby boy and it feels so good to not have this as a secret from you guys either also i saw some people wondering how we found out the gender so early since i'm 14 weeks so i don't know if this is like a normal thing everywhere or not at this point i know a lot of people have to wait to find out the sex when they do it on the sonogram but at 10 weeks i had to go in and get a ton of blood drawn for checking checking a bunch of stuff genetic screenings and things i can't remember the word i'm sorry but through that they also checked um the gender and then we also did um a carrier screening and we had totally forgotten that we worked with invite <laughs> years ago before we were trying 
um, to see what we were carriers of. And of course the results came back the same. A total brain fart. But yeah, that's how we were able to find out the gender so early. We do have like a funny story of <laughs> finding out it didn't go as planned. So I'll share that with Yar another day. Maybe he and I can do like a sit down chit. Gee, are you sure you wanna have him on camera? Are you sure you wanna have him on camera to speak about anything about the baby at this point? Chat Q and A. We also posted uh, a different <laughs> gender reveal um, with Bruno over on Instagram. If you guys wanna check that out. Since being on vacation last week, I have a couple episodes of my shows to watch. So I am gonna end up with, spoiler alert, they wanted her to be my friends. When Daisy was doing her interview, them giving back up or maybe not. Maybe it's like a theory, people. Anyway, another time, um, but yeah, baby boy coming. Don't touch your stomach. There's nothing there, you fucking idiot. It's just fat at the moment. At the end of September, so. I will see you guys in a few days and let me know what other pregnancy content you have. Ugh. <laughs> All right, guys. I have to tell you, I, I read a lot of comments on my last, um, the last one that I posted of this heifer when I posted yesterday. I did a double one, just random reacts. And you guys are still loving them. So thank you all so much. Thank you all for your nice comments. Um, I do, I like them and I put a little heart on them just so you guys know that I've acknowledged you guys. I don't just go through them. I actually read each and every one. It's easy to read in each and every one, but it's hard to reply to everybody. But as long as you guys know that I am reading your comments and most of you guys, I mean, you're all so lovely. You're all saying, thank you so much, Priscilla. You make me laugh. Thank you. You make me laugh. We love your vlogs. We like how, you know, regular you upload and this, this and that. So I really do appreciate that. Thank you for telling me. And I'm glad, I'm so glad that you guys are enjoying it because this is just a bit of fun. This is just a hobby and it's just a bit of fun on the side and it gets us all together and we can have a laugh about it and, you know, not take her too seriously. I just close the laptop and go on with my day. I don't give her a second thought unless I'm, I see something really um, bad I shouldn't be eating or I'm at the gym and I'm thinking, oh, I wonder if she's gone to the gym, you know. <laughs> That's the only time I think of the heifer. It's not like I spend my whole life thinking about her. Um, but yeah, I just want you guys to know that you're all very, very appreciated. Thank you so much for subscribing. Um, thank you for liking the videos and thank you for commenting and just for being here in general. All right. And I will put another one, another video out for you guys later on today. All right, my loves. Have a good one and I'll speak to you all soon.